All right, Bob, we had some wild weather overnight. Yeah, we did. We had a bit of thunder, some lightning last night, and some rain. And that has just wound down. Here's our weather headlines. It looks like the whole weekend won't be a washout, but a wet start to the weekend today and tomorrow, but drier on Sunday and sunny and toasty warm Monday and Tuesday. Say hello to the 90s once again Monday and Tuesday, but thunderstorms return on Wednesday. There is a look at Doppler radar, our radar loop from the last six hours. The showers moved up from Owyhee County, moved right across our area overnight, and even some thunder might have woken you up last night. Here's a look at uh, where it's still raining over there in Malheur County, central Malheur County, still seeing some lingering showers showing up on Doppler radar. And it looks like the showers have wound down up there around Cascade. Looking pretty good out there off to our east, clear skies. To the east, a few clouds to our west, 57 degrees, winds are calm, humidity pretty high because of the rain last night, 87%. And here's some other temperatures across our area. Looks like Ontario especially warm at 64 degrees. Most locations here in the valley in the 50s, mountain locations 48 in McCall, 36 degrees in Stanley, and Haley is at 50 degrees. Looking for a high near 84 for today, 6 degrees above normal, which is 78, so we were below normal yesterday, back above normal today. The overnight low pretty mild because we're expecting some clouds to tuck us in. 60 degrees is what we're forecasting. Normal is 51. And our record high on the state, 95 degrees for this June 5th. Well, we have a low pressure system that will affect us with some showers for today. We'll slowly move to the east on Saturday. Most of the showers will be to the southeast of Boise on Saturday. And then on Sunday, that low will continue to move to the east. And that will take the showers away from the Boise area in southwestern Idaho. So it looks like Sunday is looking nicer of the two weekend days. Right now we have some clouds moving across southwestern Idaho with some showers winding down. We're seeing some clearing skies from our east. A little break in the action for mostly sunny skies in the middle of the day. Then clouds increasing as some of this moisture rotates up. Here's our future cast. You can see that coming up from the southwest. Producing with some heating of the day, some showers, mainly mountains to the northeast maybe a few showers along our southern border. And then they died down with a setting sun. By noontime though, tomorrow we could start to see some showers and they'll become a little bit uh, more widespread to the southeast of Boise. But as we head into Sunday, that low pushes off to the east and takes its showers and clouds with it. So that will mainly affect eastern Idaho for Sunday. As far as our future radar, here's what you can expect. Later today, pretty quiet with mostly sunny skies, but then with the heating of the day, the thunderstorms start to develop over our mountains, mainly to the northeast of town and also to the southwest. Here's our forecast, mostly sunny this morning, mostly cloudy, scattered rain for Twin Falls, for Sun Valley, partly cloudy, rain and scattered thunderstorms in the afternoon for McCall, partly cloudy with scattered uh, thunderstorms in the afternoon. Thunderstorms not quite as widespread, so isolated for the western end of the valley for Ken County, isolated rain and thunderstorms this afternoon, otherwise partly cloudy, partly cloudy, scattered rain and thunderstorms in the Boise area. So. A little bit uh, more action Boise rather than the western end of the valley. So thunderstorms a possibility on Saturday. Sunday we start to clear up and dry out and we really warm up Monday and Tuesday. Mostly sunny skies. Thunderstorms could return come Wednesday. That's look at weather.